Hey you guys, it's Jess. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to give you guys a really highly requested and finally updated skincare routine video. But first, I just wanted to answer some questions about my teeth care. You guys always comment on how I have really white teeth. I mean, I guess they're white, I don't really know. But um, I use all of Crest 3D White teeth products. I use their whitening mouthwash, their Radiant Mint um, what is this toothpaste and twice a year every six months I'll use my crest white strips. This is not sponsored This is just what I've been using. I got all of these from Walmart so you can find them there So that's that on that so on into my skincare routine. It's very simple I use like three products a day and night I use the same exact products for my day care routine and my night care routine So we're just gonna get really on into this video make it simple make it sweet make it short so a little bit about my skin I kind of had to have like combination skin sometimes it's oily sometimes it's really dry and around my nose is like the driest part especially since now I have a nose ring I'm really careful about how I wash my face around my nose because I don't want to pull out you know my nose ring or whatever but um yeah that's pretty much it so I always start off with hot water so I can open up my pores so I'm just gonna rinse my face off with some hot water first So the first product I'll be using that I start off with is my Freeman Polishing Charcoal and Black Sugar Gel Mask and Scrub. It's for all skin types and it instantly detoxes pores and exfoliates for smooth skin. As you can see, it's kind of gritty, so I like to use it as an exfoliator. I don't really use it as a face mask at all. The charcoal helps with absorbing oils and impurities without over drying your skin and the black sugar helps to exfoliate away dull skin cells and it gives you great softness and clarity. That's what it says on the back of the bottle so I'm just going with that. So that's just what it is right there, you know, a little something some. I don't leave it on for very long so I'm just going to go ahead and use warm water still to go ahead and wash it off of my face. So next, I like to go in with my Freeman Detoxifying Charcoal and Black Sugar Mud Mask. It's pretty much the next step for the first thing that I use. It instantly removes impurities and nourishes for renewed skin. It's a 10 minute mask. This one doesn't have any like gritty grits in it. It's really smooth. So I just go ahead and rub that onto my face. And then I leave it on for about 10 minutes and it's enough time for it to get nice and hard and stiffen up your face. So then I'm just gonna go in with that. So as you can see now, it's dried up. My face feels very tight and pulled in. Like I'm rubbing my face, none of it's coming off. So that's how you know it's pretty much ready to be washed off. You don't wanna leave it on for too long so that it'll dry your skin. So 10 minutes is more than enough. So I'm still using warm water to help wash it off. And then when it's all off, I'm gonna go in now with colder water um, so that I can close up my pores for the next step. So for my face, I like to use a different towel or rag to dry it off other than the one that I use on my body. I don't know, I just feel like it's like a lot more, you know, sanitary, a lot more, you know, safely hygienic or whatever, I don't know. And then whatever's left, I like to just air dry because I'm extra and it just, it just seems pretty to me. So <laughs> my next step, I'm going in with my aloe vera juice. Um, it's an effective skin soother. It conditions and hydrates dry, rough, or sun-exposed skin on contact. So I like to use this. I, you have to shake it really well or else it comes out really watery. So I just shake it up and then I just pour it and rub it in throughout all my skin. It really makes my skin feel really soft and soothing. I'm not I'm not going to lie. I'm not 100% sure if it like removes dark marks or anything like that. I am dark-skinned, so my marks don't show up that much in the first place. And I'm going to sit here and lie to you guys. But yeah, it's just the next step it's a skin soother um, it's good for hydrating your skin so just go ahead and get you some aloe it'll change your life All right, so my last and favorite step is going ahead to moisturize my skin. This is from Neutrogena. It's the Hydro Boost Water Gel. I've spoken about this before in my other skincare video. It's like not a skin lotion. It's not as thick as a lotion. It's a little bit watery, but a little bit goes a very long way. It is also kind of expensive. It's like $16, but it'll last you like two months for this little bottle. So I just go ahead and rub that into my skin. It instantly quenches skin and keeps it looking smooth, supple, and hydrated day after day. 
today. I just really love the way that it feels on my skin. It's very soft and very smooth and it just makes my fit skin feel like nice and juicy or whatever. So I really, really, really like this product. This is probably my favorite one out of all of my skincare products. I got this from Walmart. I got my two face masks and scrubs from Sally's and I got my aloe vera juice from my Whole Foods store. And that is pretty much my entire skincare routine, you guys. This is what I do in the mornings, and it's what I do at night as well. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below, and I will get back to you guys. Love y'all so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!